that is the screen where fans will be watching the game tonight here at Nathan Phillips Square, a.k.a. the Nest. Now, some fans are beginning to arrive. We've got some here in costumes, which perhaps could scare some of the children this evening. We also have some who've arrived early here to get a front row seat. Yes, the early bird does get the worm at the Nest. Now, you'd be hard-pressed to take five steps in the city today without seeing signs of Blue Jays fever. Let's go Blue Jays! From our street corners. Let's go Blue Jays! Let's go Blue Jays! Woo! Let's do this! To our high schools. Let's go Blue Jays! Let's go! First responders. Go Jays! Go! Woo! To City Hall. We had dreams and we always want to win. But we cannot win without you. The pulse of Blue Jays Nation is beating strong today. Even those without one are repping the Bluebird swag. There's a couple coming down. There's a Blue Jays hat like right behind you. It's it's great. It's I flew all the way from Edmonton, like specifically to be here for the Blue Jays playoffs. Even our cameraman Steve Bourne couldn't help but get caught up in today's sea of blue spilling into the streets. Now, in case you needed some reminding, this was last year. Back in the spring, we spoke with fans ahead of the home opener, whose hopes were still out of this world. I actually found Jose Bautista's bat in outer space on my way here. You did? I did. I did find the bat. The last month has been tough to watch and brought fans back down to planet Earth. But it's important to remember, this is what we hope for every season. I scream at the TV at work and my boss is constantly like, stop. It's been incredibly stressful, but to be honest, I've been wanting this for the longest time. And I, we finally get it, and this is what it feels like. There's nothing like baseball in the fall to bring out the weirdest and wackiest in fans. Does Rosie have any superstitions when watching the game? Um, well, she doesn't like to wash her jersey, and she doesn't like to have a bath before the game. <laughs> <laughs> when Rosie doesn't have a bath, they win. Rosie, so no bath no, today. No bath, Rosie. <laughs> Did you sleep in this shirt last night? No, no, no. I. Um, <laughs> In, in the last few wins, I've been wearing this shirt and one other shirt. Do whatever you think is necessary to help the team, but at the end, there's only one thing that matters most for our Jays. Win, and they're in. We're going to take it all the way! Wild card! As some fans here at the Nest obviously don't have a ticket, those who did manage to get a ticket lined up last night beginning at 10.30 p.m. at the Rogers Centre. You just met Rosie the dog while well, her owner Violet got a ticket. She said she bought that ticket for Rosie. I'm sticking with the animal theme. Ahead on City News, I speak with a bird expert who tells us who dominates the feathered kingdom, the Blue Jay or the Oriole.